In an attempt to stimulate the local economy and attract visitors and business partners, the city of Crisfield is proposing a new arts and entertainment district. A meeting was held Thursday at the library on Collins Street to gauge public reaction, and the vast majority were on board with the idea. Well, and there's a lot of local artists. Uh, there's a lot of um, uh, craftspeople, and there's a lot of musicians. So, um, you know, I think it could be very beneficial for the town to amalgamate all the uh, energy and, uh, and create uh, a nice little art, arts district. Rick Pollitt, city manager, says Crisfield is filled with creativity and this is a way to harness and nurture that talent. We just want to have an opportunity for people to, who don't have the resources to develop their talents and then promote them and, and share them. We want to give them a way to do that. Property owners and residents in the district could see more money in their pockets with tax credits or income tax benefits available as long as they produce some form of art. And Pollitt says it is a win-win situation, telling 47 ABC history shows tax credits in arts and entertainment districts leads to growth in tax revenues. Hopefully it will develop the, the shops where people can come and put their, uh, their wares on display, their, their, the products of their art. Uh, other businesses will come to the area just to be able to feed off of the traffic. So it's a good economic development tool for bringing in other businesses as well. The next step is to get volunteers together and approach the county commissioners. As of now, Pollitt says the city is very encouraged at the prospect of a new district for Chris Fields residents to put their talents on display. Just to finally have a way of putting some structure to it and bringing some attention and giving opportunities for people to develop their talents is something we're all very excited about. Brandon Bossert, 47 ABC.